These are some of the best landing spots in season 3 of chapter 5 that absolutely nobody talks about and those 7 spots guarantee crazy loot and easy path to victory so even if you are genuinely terrible at fortnite these drops will guarantee you a victory royale and the first drop on our list is the wreck mill it's located exactly here just below the nitro drum so what you want to do is land here just in front of this house and you will go into that house because in that house you will find at least one chest you can find up to two chests here but you know that depends on the spawn rate and now we will leave this house and go down here and here we'll find another at least one chest but you can find up to two chests here and go back up and now you will want to go up to John Z as he will give you a big potion and you can also buy Thunder Burst SMG from him for 300 gold and after you did that you will go here just in front of this uh, windmill and here you will take the treasure board and this will mark up two spots on your map that the buried treasures will be in and now let's go with the second spot which is called the dam bridge it's located exactly here just below the wreck mill and you can pretty much land wherever you want as i would say this spot doesn't have a particular loot route that you should follow so you can loot it however you like and there is a lot to loot here because you can find up to 12 chests here and one of them even can be a rare chest and once you are done looting and somehow don't have full potion you can jump into this um not pull into this water as it will heal your potion every second and on this spot you also can find cars so you will want to grab one and go through this little uh, not even a tunnel i don't know how to call this because here you will find two modes to the car the bumper one of the bumpers and either off-road tires or the bulletproof tires and that's still not all because now we'll want to go down here take this left turn here and here you will find this uh, little bridge here you will be able to find up to another five chests and that's pretty much it for the second spot so let's go to the third spot which is called p-boys hq and i am aware that some of you might know this spot so if you do just skip to the next one but for those of you who who don't know it is located exactly here where the train station used to be located and you will want to land in that garage and grab some floor root and now go up because here you will find one chest in that uh, bathroom i guess and now you go up a bit more and under this roof you will find another chest and you can even go here to this other part of this spot and also loot this part and once you are done looting this uh, whole place you can go to the p-boy and it will give you a medkit but you can also buy an epic hammer pump from him but what makes this spot truly op is not the p-boy trying to sell you a pump or the or those few chests but the ability to grab a car and put all of your favorite mod on it and well we both know how powerful the cars are in this season but okay let's not talk about the cars let's go to the fourth spot and this fourth spot doesn't actually have a name so let's call this Killan's spot and it's located exactly uh here <laughs> And first you will want to land at that house because in that house you will find three chests, up to three chests, I believe so. So we will loot that house quickly, grab the chests. And now you will want to go towards those uh, windmills. I, gu I guess we can call them windmills. Uh, because here you will find additional like one chest or, or so. But what you want to actually do is go, go here and slide down because here you will find another two two or one chest so yeah open those and now we'll want to grab a car or a motorcycle and go down here to this sort of a canyon because here we will find another two chests one of them being here on this little platform another one being just underneath this uh, ramp and you will want to go even further down to be exact you will want to drop down here because in this place you will find another one up to four something like that uh, chests and also you will be able to equip your car with two car modifications a bumper and a turret and now you can push onto the nitro drum and kill the boss and grab the medallion as well as the car 
Now the fifth spot is called Cliffside Lodge and it's located exactly here and yes it seems like a tiny spot but let me explain. So what you want to do is land on the west side of this uh, tiny spot as here you will find two chests, always you will find those as those chests are guaranteed, one in that little tower and the other one in that sort of a tent. And if you didn't get any minis out of the chests you can go just down here to this little um, house, hut, whatever and drive into those cactuses and they will give you also 20 shield each. And that is yet not the end of this loot route because now you'll want to go either to restore drills and loot that POI that will likely not be looted because let's be honest nobody flies there or you can go up from this spot to this little house here as in that house you will find another uh, one or two chests and from that house and from that house you will go down to this little um dog i guess we call it dog and here you will also find another few chests and now let's go with the next spot it's located exactly here on this little island and you will want to loot that tiny island really quickly there can only be up to five chests here so it should take you like 30 seconds or so and once you've done that you can talk to Bright Rider and she will give you a big potion and also you can buy an epic boom bolt of her, uh, I mean from her and also if you somehow don't have full potion there is a bunch of barrels and also a bunch of cacti in here so we can destroy those and now you'll want to use that uh, toilet and it will teleport you to the Megalo Depot and here you will want to go that crane as here you will find another two chests that will be always here because those chests are guaranteed and you can loot this whole spot it has like 15 chests or so and once you've done that you can take a car and either go to Brutal Beachhead or the Red Line Rig where the machines or the Megalodon will be and you can then kill them grab their medallion and grab their car so now let's move on to the next spot. It is called Dirty Dog and it's located exactly here. And what you want to do is land at this crane because here you will have a guaranteed chest. Now you can go down here and grab this another chest. And you can also jump to this another platform or a ship and destroy this slayer shack as it will give you 100 potions. And now you'll want to open more chests and grab some more floor wood. And you can also go up to the NPC here as he will give you a medkit. I know it's not as useful as big potion but free medkit, okay? And also he can sell you an epic boom bolt so if you want it, buy it. And once you're happy with your loot you can grab a car and go to your left because here you will find a small sort of a lake where you will be able to find three chests each and every time as those chests are guaranteed chests and they will always be there. Okay. Okay, and you can even get legendary pump from those chests, I like that. <laughs> and of course this lake is potion lake, so if you don't have full potion you can uh, heal yourself uh, in this lake one potion every second as we all know at this point probably. And after this lake you can go up here, up this little hill to this structure as here you will be able to equip yourself with a bumper and also open one or two uh, chests. And after doing that you can take your left turn and go to a red line rig and kill the machinist and grab her medallion as well as her car. And in this video we were mostly talking about the drop spots that have been added this season but there are multiple amazing drops still on the map from the last season and if you don't want to get left behind by not knowing those insane drop spots make sure to check out this video.